Oh man, I finally got it. It's here. I can't wait. I've been eating it for a while. I hope it's not junk. Welcome to my channel everybody, my name is Tim. Welcome to Extraordinary Men. Today I am going over something I'm very excited about. I've been needing it for a while. I'm unboxing my brand new compressor and my brand new Craftsman four gallon vacuum. Stick around, let's get into it. Okay, so here's the deal. I've been wanting to vacuum for a while, but I didn't want it to be too big, too small to pay a whole lot of money. It needs to be a wet and dry vac. So here I came across the Craftsman four gallon dry vac, wet dry vac, and they're selling it at Lowe's for about 40 bucks. But here's the thing, is, is it any good? Because how often do you go out and buy something because it's on sale and then it turns out to be a piece of junk? Uh, let's check it out. All right, so opening this up, it comes, um, there's no wrapping on it, so that's kind of interesting. Um, not that I'm really, bothers me either way, but, so it has this hose right here, and we lift it up, take it out, and this is kind of how it comes, right out of the box, huh? And then, looks like we have our attachments right here. And, some, what is this? A bag? This looks, yep, yeah, a bag right there. And some feet. Yeah, there's a lot. This is, you know, this is kind of, kind of interesting because um, everything's just kind of loose in here. Normally it's wrapped up, right? But I guess they just, I guess they just decided to throw it on in here, huh? Okay. Well. Okay. So, take me out of the box. This is how it comes. Just right out of the box. No wrapping. Um, this looks, I don't know, it's kind of, kind of sketchy. It's just, it just comes out just like that, huh? One on the floor, it comes with a, uh, dry bag, one. And the hose tube extensions that come with it, which is pretty much basic for all these types, has this, like a six, six foot hose. Um, just your, just your cheap kind of plastic hose, nothing, nothing to brag home about there. And this is the vacuum, this is it. I really, I really like the size of it. Um, like I said, it's not, it's not too big, it's not too small. It does have this uh, filter cap right here. Um, Cause it blows out, as you suck in, it blows out and it has a little filter here. I haven't seen that in too many vacuums, so that's kind of nice that it has that. Uh, let's take a look at the inside of opening this guy up. It has these two big, oh, that's kind of cool. And it has this latch right here, this, this real nice grab handle, real big button. Um, I like it, the, it's uh, pretty ergonomic. Oh, okay, so you have your filter right there. It has a, an additional uh, filter that you can wrap around. Again, yeah, this is all kind of like loose in here. It's kind of, I haven't really seen that too much. Normally, like there's cardboard and a bunch of wrapping and oh, okay, okay. So if something is wrapped up. There's the wheels, that's a little wrap. Large face uh, suction head. Um, I don't know, what is this? What is this, some kind of chin guard? What is it? Let's put it together, see if it actually works. Okay, so I figure why not start right here. This is my miter stand. And uh, as you can see, I have a bunch of uh, just stuff here. Um, like you see, you see all this sawdust that I have. Um, it's just kind of a mess. I haven't really gotten to uh, figuring out a better solution. So let's start right here and let's see how well this thing will suck up all of this uh, sawdust back here.
Hey, so if you're liking this video, please don't forget to smash the like button, put a comment down below, or subscribe to my channel. Those things are greatly appreciated. And stick around to the end of the video because I'm gonna give you my final thoughts and opinions on the vacuum and the air compressor. All right. So the reason why I went with the Cobalt 26 gallon is because of this. Cobalt claims that this is 80% quieter. Now, I don't know how true that is, but we're gonna find out. Now I have the air compressor running. I have no ear hearing protection on right now. And you can kind of hear me a little bit, but there's no way I would have been in here with my old compressor um, with and talking to you the way I am right now. So that on air in its own is pretty cool. Okay, so now that I have the cobalt fully pressurized, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a little test run. Now what I got here is my 16 gauge nail gun, and I'm gonna throw some, uh, 16 gauge nails right into this wood. Let's just see how it goes. Let's just see how, how the, the pressure operates. Let's check it out. Now let's give it a couple shots. See how it goes. Okay, so my final thoughts and takeaways on the vacuum and the air compressor. Man, I'm really, really happy I got both of these two things. I've been lacking them in my garage for a little while now. Um, if I had to grade this, this vacuum, I would give it a B plus. Now, I really like a lot, you get a lot with this little vacuum. The only thing keeping it from an A is the uh, power, the sucking capacity, the sucking ability of this thing is a little underwhelming. Now, that's not saying you won't get the job done for around the house, it definitely will, but to get it in that A, give it that A grade, I would have liked to see just a little bit more uh, horsepowers on the suction. It has a three horsepower motor, which is fine. It'll do around the house, and it's also $40. You really can't complain, a lot of these Vacuums at this size are gonna come in at around the $70, $80 vacuum. So right now, with the Father's Day deal going on at Lowe's, this is a sweet little vacuum for that price. If you need something a little bit bigger, they have other options, but for this little guy, I think it, it, I think you get a lot for this price. I really do. Um, I, I think they did a really, really good job on this vacuum. The compressor, if I had to give the compressor a grade, I would give it an A. Man, I am very impressed with the build quality of the compressor. Um, just the, the quiet technology is really nice. I think, I think we kind of take for granted uh, um, how valuable our hearing is. So um, having, having your compressors, your, your loud equipment, having to reduce all of that noise is super, super important. And I think they did a really good job. Um, I would give them this thing an A plus if maybe it came with like a hose. Cobalt, if you're watching this, throw something in extra like that. It's a no brainer. This is a great, great compressor. It is on the large side. 
If it's something you're needing to transport to and from, this is not their guy. This is at home or at a, a job site and it was gonna be very, very nice. Um, I'm really, really impressed. Okay, and that's all I have for you today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that like button, drop a comment, and subscribe to my channel. Those things are greatly appreciated. Listen, if you aren't subscribed, please do so. I have a lot of new content coming out. I'm very, very excited. Until next time, stay extraordinary.